Welcome back everybody to NetApp training on N90X. In the last video, I showed you how to delete or destroy your volumes and your aggregates. But in this video, I want to show you how you create them. So it was very simple. You just go to your data on tap GUI, click on your file review. It's going to bring up uh, the file review submenu. Click on aggregates, click on add. And here you're going to get a wizard that's going to step you through creating an aggregate. Now remember, an aggregate is just a grouping of disks in your on your NetApp storage device to create um, like a container. It's not quite a virtual disk, but it's really just a container or of organizing your 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 disks, your storage, and you'll be able to specify particular things. Uh, that you'll see. For instance, give it a name. You can name your aggregate. I'll call it Ag1. And with NetApp, you have the, the possibility for double parity. Double parity gives you uh, an extra layer of protection, meaning that if you were to lose two drives, you'd still have access to all of your data. So, uh, you know, for this test environment, I'm, I'm not going to select double parity, but certainly it's best practice. Uh, for your production environment to select double parity. Uh, okay, RAID group size. I can select how many disks that would I would I want in my RAID group for this, uh, and you can pick depending upon the size of your disks, your individual disks that are in your uh, NetApp. You will have to determine, calculate how many disks you need in order to make the aggregate large enough to satisfy your needs. Click on Next. Disk selection uh, automatically allow NetApp to pick the disks that are available. The disk type, uh, any type, I don't have, uh, I have any type or fiber channel. I don't have any fiber channel disks, so I'll any type. Uh, disk size, again, any size. In, in this particular case, uh, all of my disks are 120 meg. I know it's really small, but again, this is just a simulator, and I've created this as a very small uh, the environment just for testing purposes and for showing you for training purposes. But the NetApp, I should tell you, point out, according to the documentation, this NetApp simulator actually will support up to 28 gigabytes of total storage. So it's quite big and usable for virtually any uh, demonstration, laboratory, or even pre-production type of environment. For testing anyways. Um, number of disks. Uh, okay, so uh, RAID group size is 8, number of disks is 2. Uh, here's all the information that I've uh, selected. I'm going to commit, and it's going to create my aggregate. I'm going to close it. Now, if I look at my aggregates, manage, you can see what I've created. What did I create here? I created a aggregate with 85 megabytes. So that's how you create aggregates. On the next video, I will show you how to create volumes. From all of us here at N90X, I'm Joe Moses, and I hope to see you right back here on this channel for the next video.